So our good friends over at Arteria has just released a new free plugin, but for a limited time, just for a limited time. It is free and you guys can pick it up. It's called Effects Refract and we're gonna see if it's any good. So let's go ahead and check it out right now. Bolo. So basically, FX Refract is basically like a tool to where you can refract an audio signal into multiple voices. And then you can add like different effects onto it as well. You can do it with a multitude of plugins, but with this, you can just do everything inside of one plugin. So if you're playing something and you wanna, you know, make it into multiple voices, you can do that. And you can take some very ordinary sounds and make them into some very interesting sounds. Now. You can go ahead and pick this up. All you have to do is just go to the link that I will have in the description. And then all you have to do is go into your Arteria little software management thing. And then you can just download it from there. Very easy process. And it is free. Yes, I did say it right. It is free all the way from today, December 23rd, 2023, all the way until January 4th of 2024. So if you're watching this after January 4th, 2024, it's not free no more. So don't hit me up in the comments about that. But if you are watching it today, it is free. So you guys can go ahead and pick it up right now. So let's go ahead and open up Logic and see how this thing works. All right, so we're in Logic Pro right now and we're gonna go ahead and open up the FX Refract. It is a very simple plugin. I didn't really like go through the manual or nothing like that. I just opened it up and just kind of figured it out. And uh, it's kind of geared for people who are trying to find really weird things to do with their sound, like really shape their sound into something very different from what you started with. So it's very easy and we're gonna be using this on the augmented grand piano. So um, please bear with me. I'm still very much under the weather right now. So um, if I sound real nasally or whatever, I am sick. So, <laughs> you know, just bear with me. If you hear any coughs or anything, I'm not gonna try to do any cuts or breaks or nothing like that. I'm just gonna try to go through this and so you guys can see everything that I'm doing. So we have the augmented grand piano pulled up and you know the augmented grand piano is very dope because when you play like certain keys and hold it down, it gives you this effect. Kind of dope and you can actually change stuff in that. But this is just a simple. Just a simple kind of like piano. Now let's go ahead and open this thing up real quick. And this is FX Refract right here. And let me make this a little bit bigger so you guys can see all the stuff in here. All right, there we go. So right now, when you open this up, we have a, uh, a input right here, input gain. We have an output gain on here. We have a refraction. We have the amount of refraction we can put on there. We have the amount of voices that we can put on a the refraction. Then we have a refraction modulation on there, okay? So it controls the LFO amount of the refraction. So as you guys can see right here, here's the LFO. You can change the different wavelengths of the LFO right here. And then you have the rate of the LFO. And then you can go ahead and either turn this up or turn that down to affect the LFO. And then you have this side right here, you have different effects you can put on the refraction. You have a bandpass, a comb filter, bit crusher, distortion, and a harmonizer, which is very dope for people who are really not players like that. And then, of course, from here, you can go ahead and add, you know, different, um, you can add a modulation to that as well. You have a wet dry on here, and then you have an output. So you can turn this up or down on the output as well. And that's pretty much it. And it comes with a whole bunch of, of uh, different presets on here as well. So you have different type of presets you can put on here. So as of right now, when we just play the piano by itself, sounds like that. Let's turn it on right now. So as soon as we turn it on, hear that? Already you hear a difference. And then we can turn this amount up and down. So turn it down and turn it up. So already we have a dope sound. It's kind of dope. So from that point, what we can do is we can actually add an effect to that. Now, what we can do is we can go ahead and go to where it says bypass, and then we can actually turn this on to like bandpass right here. So we can play this. And as you guys can see, 
it affects what we already have. So we play this. And then more and more we add on there. It's kind of dope. And then we can add a resonance on there as well. Let me turn this back. Really dope. Um, and now we can actually go through the next one. We got a comb filter on here, combination filter. We can turn the resonance on this up and turn the, the cutoff, which is kind of dope. Seems pretty cool. And then we have a bit crusher, very dope as well. So if we play it, hear that? And then we can turn this up. And then we have the bit depth as well. And of course, the lower you go, the more funky it sounds. That's cool. And then we're gonna go down to distortion. And then we turn this drive up. And then we have different algorithms for the distortion. We got tape. What's this, uh, germanium, salt bounce. So that's kind of cool. And sign. So they had the distortion. And then we have one of my favorites on here, which is the harmonizer, okay? Watch this. We can play just one note, and we have it on the octave chord right here. Watch this. Very dope. And then what you can do is you can turn this up, the spray. That's dope. And then you have different uh, chords on here. So now we can go to a fifth. And then we either go back to uh, uh, um, like, what is that? We had a major seven. This is a regular seven chord. And then they actually have a minor chord on here too. I was looking for that. Here it is, a minor. So it's a lot of cool things you can do and that's just with one sound. So let me show you something even better about this. So now, now that we have this, let's go back to like our band pass right here, right? And let's go ahead and add some modulation to this. Let's go ahead and turn these voices down to about, uh, let's do about four voices, right? And then let's turn the modulation up. We're gonna do, yeah, let's keep it about right there. And we're gonna turn this rate to about, uh, let's do, let's do a one fourth, okay? So now that we have that, we turn this refraction modulation up, watch this. So we got that, and then we're gonna turn off this, turn on this cutoff mod right here on the band pass right here, right? And we're gonna turn this up a little bit and watch what happens. Super dope, you can turn the resonance up and down. And now the good thing about it is you can do it with everything. So if you want to go to the Bit Crusher, watch this. And that is just with this one sound right here, the piano. That's what it all, this is what it on. It's crazy. Let's go right here to uh, Distortion. Let's turn this rate up a little bit more. Let's go to like a one eighth. Oh, that's actually kind of dope right there. And then since I already have like a template with some sounds and stuff in here, in which I recommend a lot of you guys to make your own templates, and this is how you can build beats really fast. Now, if I want to go ahead and record some in here,
sounds good already. And let's let's bypass this. That's how it sounds without the effect. And then just like that, we can already go ahead and like add like a little quick little 808 to it. And then I don't even know what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna try to make some real quick. Let's try some. I messed up, but I, I'm just doing something really quick. But as you guys can see, it is very easy to take just a simple sound on here, add some effects and do everything within one plugin. And right now this plugin is for free, completely free all the way into January 4th, 2024. So you guys need to hurry up and jump on this. It is completely free. Now for you guys who got the crack version of that arterial stuff, I don't know if you know you want to download this, but for all you people who are doing the right thing, go ahead and get this plugin. It's dope. Basically, it does like what it would probably take three or four different plugins, like different effects plugins. It'll take all those and just combine those all into one plugin, and that way you can really create some really dope stuff. And then they have a whole bunch of other like presets and stuff as well, so you guys can create. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys learned something from it and uh, get this plug in. Link will be in the description. And like I always say, peace out.